the, whether it be embassy or high commission that uh, is in a country. Now in Nigeria, South Africa has a high commission and it's really wonderful to have come here and experienced a typical South African braai. And representing us here in Nigeria is uh, His Excellency Lulum Guni. Thank you so very, very much for having us here and hosting us in your home. Well, thanks very much for having come. We see that South African Airways has already been operating in Lagos for many, many years, and now another route in Abuja. I mean, do you think that this is a, it's a great move for strengthening ties, particularly in West Africa? Well, I think uh, this is going to strengthen our presence in West Africa. And of course, it's also going to increase the flow both from South Africa to Nigeria and from Nigeria to South Africa. So strengthening these people-to-people -people, uh, uh, relationships and business, of course, is going to flourish in the process. When we look at South Africa and Nigeria, I mean, relations are, I imagine, very, very good. But, you know, from the outside looking in, I suppose you being here, you know a lot more. What are relations like? No, I think uh, relations are, are growing and they are becoming stronger. And uh, this has been evidenced by the fact that uh, President Buhari has decided that South African President Jacob Zuma should be the first head of state to be received by him in Nigeria. So this clearly indicates how uh, important our relations are to Nigeria and of course to our president and uh, the South Africans. South Africa has always been the largest economy in Africa. Nigeria took over that position but obviously um, you know with uh, with a lot of companies operating here in Nigeria there is still potential for more companies to to come in and do business. I mean the opportunities, the business opportunities in Nigeria for South Africa, how big are they? Nigeria has a lot of solid minerals and of course gas. And South Africa has a wealth of experience in the field of mining. So South Africans have the opportunity. Actually Nigerians are inviting us, say South Africa come and help us to unleash this potential in the field of mining. Wherever you go, there's MTN everywhere, and we all know what's happening with MTN with the fine. I mean, what is the latest? What is the update with MTN? All is not lost. We are still uh, hoping that the history that which we have built together with Nigerians will come in to inform the way in which maybe this uh, huge fine can be contained. What's your advice to South Africans? Is it safe to come to Nigeria? It's safe to come to Nigeria for South Africans, but obviously we would always advise them the areas they need to keep away from. You can still continue with your life without any problem. And you can still come and do business here without any fear of challenges. Obviously, you've got to be vigilant. Hi, Commissioner. Thank you very, very much for talking to us here on the program. And, of course, thanks so much for hosting us here this evening.